Kiseitze Revi. So this Aliyah, we have the topic Kiseitze Machana Al Oivecha V'Nishmar To Mikol Davara. Right, whenever you go out to war, uh, in your Machana you have to protect yourself against bad things. So you would think, well, what happens during war? Right, Th- uh, uh, our worst behaviors come out. Right, we're, we're we're murdering, we're raping, we're pillaging. Our worst things come out, and the Torah wants to keep us in check. Right, or they might give us uh, sort of like Geneva Convention type rules how to behave, and the Torah does do that, just not here. So, what are the first? What's the first thing that the pasuk does say? It doesn't say anything Geneva Convention wise. It says, uh, "Someone that is a balkari is in a mission at night. What does he do? He has to, he has to go to the mikvah, wait till nightfall. That doesn't. That that's that that's." That's the type of rules that the Pasuk is saying. And then what's the next rule? It says that uh, you have to have a place to go outside, a designated place, which Rashi explains means uh, to use the bathroom. You have to be able to go there. And what type of weapon do you have to have? Every soldier has to have a, 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 a shovel to dig, to dig a hole uh, for, for when they have to use the bathroom. These are very interesting rules that the Torah is putting forth. And finally, what does it say? It says that uh, Hashem is going to walk through the middle of your camp. So what do we learn about Kedusha Samachana? We learn that that uh, it, we don't, we, we're not like regular camps uh, when we go out to war. We don't win by strength. We win with the Yad Hashem. And the way the Yad Hashem works is, is that we have to be tar, we have to be clean. How do we be clean and physically clean? By, by going out of the Machana, keeping, keeping our bathroom needs outside, being able to do that and spiritually clean. And by doing that, the Rebbe Shalom is able to literally walk through our camp. And of course, that is our success. Throughout the ages, Klai Yisrael has never ever won a war based on strength, based on size, but only through the Yad Hashem. If we're, if we're clean physically and we're clean spiritually, then Hashem is with us.